Hello everyone, this is Arthur from DeepXlow and today I'm excited to introduce you to one of our innovative solutions from our detonator crimping portfolio, the crimper control panel. In this video, I'll guide you through its exceptional features, installation process and the operating procedures. Detonator failure is a critical issue often caused by improper crimping. This can arise from both operator errors and variation in pneumatic input pressure, leading to incomplete crimps and potential safety hazards. To address these challenges, we have developed the crimper control panel, which effectively resolves both issues simultaneously. It features an electric pressure sensor housed in an IP66 or NEMA 4 rated enclosure. When the operator initiates the crimping command, the sensor takes control and ensures that the crimper retracts only when the set pressure is reached, guaranteeing a perfect crimp every time. By incorporating this control panel into your detonator crimping process, you can significantly minimize the risk of failure, enhance operational efficiency, and ensure optimal safety standards. The installation process for the crimper control panel is straightforward and requires both a pneumatic connection and a single phase electrical connection. To install the single phase electrical connection, first open the control panel using the key provided. Then locate the MCB in the control panel and insert the line and neutral wires from the input electrical connection into the respective terminals of the MCB. Ensure that the electrical connections are secure and properly tightened. Once you have connected the electrical connection, close the panel back again. To connect the pneumatic connections, identify the port marked PN on the control panel. Using an 8mm OD pipe, connect the input pneumatic pipe to the PN port on the control panel. Using a similar pipe, connect the port marked top on the control panel to the upper connection port on the crimper and similarly connect the port marked bottom on the control panel to the bottom connector on the crimper. Ensure that the pneumatic connections are properly secured and the pipes are tightly fitted. Once you have completed these steps, the crimper control panel will be successfully installed. To ensure proper operation of the crimper control panel and achieve optimal crimping results, please follow these instructions for setting the pressure and adjusting the crimper's crimp height. Locate the knob on the bottom of the crimper. Turn the knob clockwise or counterclockwise to raise or lower the crimp height according to your requirements. Locate the pressure sensor fitted inside the control panel. Press the set button until P1 is displayed on the screen. Use the arrow buttons to adjust the pressure to the desired level. For optimal results, we recommend a pressure of 6 bar. Once the desired pressure is set, press the set button again to confirm the pressure settings and return to the previous screen. With the crimper control panel and crimper properly set up, insert the detonator into the crimper and press the foot pedal valve or the designated crimping command to initiate the crimping process. The control panel in coordination with the pressure sensor will ensure that the crimp retracts only after achieving the set pressure, guaranteeing a perfect crimp. At DeepXlow, we strive to provide cutting edge solutions that address industry challenges and the crimper control panel is a testament to our commitment. By incorporating this technology into your detonator crimping process, you can elevate operational efficiency, reduce cost and enhance overall safety. Thank you for your time. Should you have any questions or require further information, please don't hesitate to reach out to us.